You can peacefully stop. I have every. Come on, sorry. No. I, I don't stop my camera. Listen to him. I know okay. one guy, but you're here. They yeah. run this. No, I understand. We, want to. we had this conversation. See, he said, I know what the one guys, but you're here. It's still a fucking public entity. Come on, Officer Rogers. You're supposed to be a sergeant. For one, your shirt ain't completely buckled up. Let's get that. Like, you're looking sloppy. Are you a sergeant, man? Stand up straight. Two. Come on, man. During many of these encounters, police are called. It's really mutual respect. If you show up and give anybody you're dealing with the respect that they deserve, you're going to get it back. Ridgefield police told us they conduct internal training on First Amendment rights. We advise the public and all the other town agencies to do the same internally is to educate their employees on First Amendment rights because we know they could show up any day at any time. Turn me up, Congratulations, get up. Do a quick reaction video. Uh, um, you want to be on your camera? Said I said I don't want to be on your camera. Uh, uh, I'm just peaceful, peacefully recording. That's all. I said, but I said I don't want to be on there. You can report, but I don't want to be on your camera. That's one. She said I can do it. I'll take care of the supervisor. Just step back so she. Why are you the recording? Said again. Why are you recording? Uh, like I was telling them, I'm just here. Uh. You guys, a beautiful state, documenting, gathering information for a story. That's about it. No, I'm not trying to record you, sir. Hey, on that one, I took the little clip. Well, I didn't even take the clip out. Matter of fact, he was like unbothered. So as y'all seen, I wasn't recording him. Let me let me go back real quick. Y'all see that, right? So when I finally was ready to conduct my business, right? I got in line. Mind you, there's nobody in the post office. Her, him, and there's like one other person, but he was waiting on another lady who's over here. And let me say this too. I was already here before these people. But anyway, after she got done, it was his turn to go up front, right? He was like, ah, ah, ah. you know how elderly people are, you know what I'm saying? So he left. He left. So as I'm walking up towards the front, we're going we gonna to get to it. But as I'm walking up towards the front, she decides to go in the back. So later in the video, y'all going to hear uh, the police. Well, actually, that's part two. But uh, they said that I was impeding on their customers and caused their customers to leave. Now, again, that is not true. When he left, she left. I went up front. She went in the back. I had to cut some of it out. That video would have been, honestly, y'all, my video would have been like an hour and a half long. You know what I'm saying? So I'm standing right here for a solid close to 15 minutes, just commentating over the video facing that way. I look behind me. There's two customers that walked in. They're standing about right here just waiting. We all just waiting for somebody to come up front. They end up leaving. And then you're going to see later in the video, the manager come out and said that I caused them to leave. No, that's not true at all. They never say anything about me recording. They left because we were all standing here waiting for somebody to come up front. Let's get some shit straight. I hope they watch this video too. Gathering information for a story. That's about it. See, no, I'm not trying to record you, sir. Oh, right there. Walking away. Maybe I don't get no help today. I don't know. You making a yeah, I was waiting. And as soon as okay, I. But can you give us one second because you got. See, when she said that at that precise moment, when she said that, I was like, yeah, she probably going to end up calling the law enforcement. And obviously I mean, you she have did. the right to be cooking. See, I don't mind you guys doing whatever genres you do. And I mm -hmm. see there is a such thing as respect. My clerk is out here. I don't mind y'all doing what y'all doing, but there is a such thing as respect my clerk. Now, let me say this real quick. In the beginning of this video, I had a dialogue with the clerk. That was it. I ain't spoke to her since then. I conducted, did what I needed to do. By the time I was ready to get my stamp, I went in line. That's when y'all seen the old man had a little conversation as it's my turn because he left. So I'm next in line as I'm walking towards the front. The clerk decides to go in the back. So now 
where does respect come into the play, right? Like, I, it's this video still irks my nerves to this day. You've made my customers leave. Now I'm asking you to leave. Well, they See, brought the truckload officers. She said I made her customers leave. That's that's false. Didn't they? Let's just get just to the video. Them. We need to get. Hey. Oh. Let's go over here. Congratulations, kid. I'm gonna come through person heaven. Talking to the internet, but when they see me, they don't want Make sure y'all go to TuneIn TV and go ahead and subscribe over there too. Tune in on the Missouri side at another post office. Like I mentioned before, hopefully our rights can be respected. Respected. Film in public. Public. Get a few documents that we need to get. Uh-huh. Maybe purchase a few stamps. Yeah. Let's just get to I ain't gonna play the whole thing. <laughs> I ain't gonna play the whole thing. We're just gonna get to the to the key points real quick. Make a quick video. Other side right here. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just peacefully recording. Oh, we still ain't located it yet. I don't know where it's. I don't think they have it posted. See how there's when I first walked in, there's only two people in there. That's it. Hopefully somebody come up front. You mean? To see. Now I'm coming up into conducting business. Nobody's in line. Nobody's even in there at this point. I don't um, want to be on your camera. Say I said, I don't want to be on your camera. Uh, uh, I'm just peaceful, peacefully recording, that's all. Y'all see the person in the corner? Report, but I don't want to be on your camera. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I mean, you're in public, but um, there's a few things I do need to get whenever you're, you're available. What you need? Um, I need, um, uh, what is it? What she said she needed? Okay, so. I just don't want to do it in the video. Oh, I mean, I understand. But. That's it. <laughs> <sighs> well, they don't have any passport applications. I never heard of that before. Post office, but. Not a passport office, that's why. This office doesn't process. Now, see, I actually, she didn't need to say anything. I was talking and commentating on my, over my video. She didn't have to say nothing. Passport, so they don't give us applications. Huh. Okay. Well, okay. if you don't have it, you don't have it, right? Okay. But I will need to get uh, probably a stamp here in a, here in a minute. Okay. So, Sixty-eight cents. Uh, not right Seven. now. Not right now, but I will. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Y'all heard that, right? Y'all heard that. She was okay with it. I said that I'm gonna get a stamp. She tried to, you know. Uh, make the make the purchase right then and there. I wasn't ready, and that was it. I ain't talked to her since. Now, how does this manager gonna say that I was pretty much disrespecting her clerk, saying that you know uh, you don't have any, you're not giving any respect to my clerk? Da, da, da. How everything was fine right there. Let's see what's on the what you need. See what I'm saying? So let's just need to start for it. Okay. But I stay. But let's okay. then well, the manager come out. Here, I'm gonna just stand right back. Hold on, hold on. She's informed as well. Hold on, this dude come out. This guy right here. Sir, are you a filming? Huh? Are you filming in here? For sure. Uh, you can't maybe. Can I film in this section? You can go out there, but you cannot do it in here, please. You sure? Yes, sir. Is there any rules or regulations yes, that is, say sir. you can't? Could you please, please stop filming? You can't film inside of here. Oh, well, I mean, you know, you can ask, but I, I can respectfully decline. And I can... He didn't like that. <laughs> he seems unbothered. <laughs> he didn't like that. Oh, shit, he didn't like that at all. Uh, well, maybe he can get some help. Maybe he can bring someone out here and educate him. Um, she says she can. All right, so anyway, a lady come out. Oh, uh, okay, okay, Every okay. Every post office does not do passports. Not even, okay. Union Station. See, I learned something. Waldo, Martin City. Okay. I, uh, That's something I didn't know. I thought every every post office do passports. See, I'm learning. I'm learning every day, gang. You know what I'm saying? You got you got to I got to go out and do these type of things so I can continue to learn as well as put my head in the books and learn the laws and my, you know, certain state regulations and penal codes and certain things of that nature. But I got to start somewhere. I'm a rookie at this audit and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Whether you like it or not, regardless, I'm going to do me. My channels is for me and my pleasure and my enjoyment. And if others love it and enjoy it, it's for them as well. But ultimately, 
I made all I made tune in TV. I made tune in artists, tune in reactions, tune in gaming, tune in food TV. All this is for me. Just throw that out there. I just want to, so people won't think, oh, you're just trying to get views. You're no, since day one, I don't give a fuck about views. I don't even give a damn about subscribers for real. Although I appreciate and love all y'all that subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Much love. I can't even make a heart, but much love right there. But y'all get what I'm saying, though. But I, I will be, you know, uh, needing service. Say it again? What group are you in? Well, I'm an independent journalist. Uh, okay. Just here in you guys' city, gathering content for a story. See, she, uh, she cool. Local post. She, she, she seems cool with it. Everything was fine. And then listen to what she says. I mean, I... Y'all, y'all hear that? She said, "All I ask is for you to stand over here, and you can record as much as you like." So it was never a problem. It was never a problem. I mean, yeah, if, if, if nobody's in line, you know, of course I'll stand. But if nobody's around, and then make sure that the customers they may not want to be filmed. So. Can you repeat that? I couldn't hear. Make sure our customers may not want to be filmed. So as you stand, that's why I ask you just to step back over in the corner, and you can watch okay. everything. Well, What's the difference? If I'm standing right here in the corner and there's three, four customers over there and my camera's this way, what's the difference? And I'm zooming in from standing right here. There's no difference. But again, as y'all see, go watch the full video. Part two is coming to coming soon on tune in audits. Uh, I'm going to drop part two on this channel probably like next week or something. So if y'all really want to see it first, it's actually dropping tomorrow. I don't know when I'm going to drop this. It's probably already dropped. I don't even know when I'm going to drop this reaction video. But anyway, uh, yeah, I lost train of thought, man. I'm high. Well, like I said, I'm not here to record anybody. You know, if they happen to get in the lens. You, you know, see what I'm saying? But I'm not here to. All right, let's fast forward a little bit. I'll be in the way. Just hear the piece. First lady said she didn't want to be recorded. No, she was a little bit unsure if we could or not. Then you seen that the guy came out and he said, oh, you can't record. You seen the supervisor came out and. Hopefully she educated and uh, told her, like I said, there's nothing back here. Uh, so far, it looks like stand in line. And go ahead. But y'all hear what so, I'm saying? I walked back in. I'm going to just uh, stand. I did my little commentating, right? Now, let me say this, too. Mind you, this whole video, not a single, besides that guy, I forgot. Besides this guy y'all about to see right now, he's the only one that says something about recording. The only one. All these other people that was in here, and again, there was really nobody in here. I was here before all these people. When I first walked in, I think it was, what, two people in there? You know what I'm saying? But and nobody said mind. nothing. Go ahead and get my uh, my stamp. See, I said I'm going to stand in line. The recording. Say it again. Why are you recording? Uh, like I was telling them, I'm just here uh, in you guys' beautiful state documenting, gathering information for a story. That's about it. I'm not, I'm not interested in being. I'm not trying to record you, sir. No, I understand. You see how I'm respectful. I understand. I understand. But respectfully, sir, I'm not trying to record you. But again, you got to understand you in public. You know what I'm saying? You know, he's old school. So he might be in his old school ways. Don't want to be on camera. Woo, woo, woo. But we in times now where you walk outside your front door, there's a camera everywhere. So you might as well already expect to be recorded. You see what I'm saying? So, uh, again, I was never mean to him. I was never nefarious to him. I never uh, 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 said anything disrespectful. I never had no ill intent, but he was just unhinged. He was, he, uh, I ain't trying to. He was unhinged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I understand. I'm not trying to record you. You see how I'm not recording him. He's just in my direction of filming. I, if anything, I'm filming her. So now watch right, this. Next, sir. Go ahead, go you ahead. sure? You go ahead, man. Go ahead. Oh, you fine. He decided to leave. Now, this is where it gets tricky, gang. Uh, you hear what I said? I said, all right. So now I'm conducting my business. At this point, I'm already done. We 14. I wasn't even trying to get a reaction with anybody. I wasn't even trying. I was just trying to make sure that my rights weren't trampled on, that I can peacefully record in public, in a public space, not bother nobody, not impeding on no business, no nothing. As I'm walking up to finally get my stamp so I can go, this is what happens. She sees me. She walks in the back. She's walking away. She walked away. Maybe I don't get no help today. I don't know. Now, y'all seen that one guy there. It was just him. I don't understand, man. We don't want to 
be here all day, man. You see? You, know? you see what I'm saying? I'm not trying to be there all day. Record. That's about it. Sir, you Now, again, I got proof for everything. I got the full link videos of all this. I was legit standing there for maybe 14 minutes, 15, 16 minutes. Now, mind you, when you just stand in there waiting for somebody to come up front, that's a long time. Legit 14, 15, 16 minutes. So as I'm sitting there, I'm standing there with my camera just right there facing that way, commentating over my video. I happen to look back. I didn't even go like this. I happen to look back. I seen two customers came in. They were just standing there. We all just waiting. Four minutes go by five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes, eight minutes, nine minutes, 10 minutes. They left. So finally, she comes around and listen what she say. Yeah, I was waiting and as soon as I... Right, but she's, can you give us one second because See, you've got... She's thinking about calling the cops. Right. to record. Right. But you have your camera like right in her face as she... That's a fucking lie. I never had my, my camera in her face. Ever. Ever. And if you want to... If we break it down, let's break it down, gang. If you in a public entity, right, and say, you know, whatever place you have the right to record, da, 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 da. as long as I'm not going over any restricted area. So if I'm right here, this is public and past this table is, you know, they section. I can see if my camera is over here. But if I'm standing here in my own bubble and my camera is close to my chest like this, how am I putting that in her face? Let's make it make sense, lady. I don't. Right in your face is like going beyond a restricted access at point. I'm just right you see what I'm saying? I respect your customers. I don't mind you guys doing whatever genres you do. She don't care. There is a such thing as respect. My clerk has walked away because she doesn't want you to record her like that. Right. But unfortunately, she works in public. But she's a public official, correct? She may be. But and she I, may I, be? I just want to, you know. I never, I never put my camera in her face. You said I put it in her face, and I never put my camera in her face. You are in here. Be respectful. We have. Customers. I have been. I've, I've told you from the jump. Walk out because they don't want to be recorded. No. Okay. Well, the one guy. Yeah, but again, he's in public, and I wasn't recording him. You specifically said I'm okay with what I'm doing, but then you want to say just don't record our customers, right? I wasn't recording their customers. Y'all seen the perfect angle. I'm directly to that public official right there behind that counter. That's it. He chose to leave. So now she want to say, I'm making her uh, uh, customers leave. I'm doing this. I'm doing that. Just, just making a bullshit. That's totally false. The people. Well, yeah, let's, let's fast forward it. Respectfully ask and I can respectfully decline. Yeah, I don't think she liked that one right there. Yeah, she don't think she liked that. So is nobody going to help me? It totally no. ignored me. Totally ignored oh me. Oh, my gosh. Now, I'm going to say this. So while all this going on, right? Let me go ahead and mute this real quick. She goes in the back. I see her right here. I already knew she was about to call law enforcement, right? Now, fast forward after she do, she do all that. So I go back in my little corner peacefully. And uh, I call on the Pope. Here, so, gosh. Now, at this point, after she, I'm assuming, called the police. Look at this. There's only one person in here. So it started getting a little busy. I'm standing over here in this corner. She's literally now at this point, three employees come out to help all these people. But nobody wants to help me. Like, I tried to go up front to get my stamp so I can leave. She decided to, the other lady decided to go in the back for 15 minutes. Man, I, somebody let me know, what can I do, bro? Like, I really want to file a complaint on this place, man. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. See, no help. Excuse me, sir. Is that actually, she called law enforcement. No, but you were talking to uh, station manager. She's a station manager. Mm -hmm. um, I was trying to conduct some business here, and it seems like I'm getting denied. Okay, you're not denied. I was. Yeah, before anybody came in here, I'll just walk right up there just to get some stamps. Right and she just left. And then Thank two customers got you. upset hi, hi. because hi. they've taken forever. And then they left. And then you guys, the supervisor, manager came and said, 
you know, I caused them to leave. No, there was nobody up front. But you work for the public, yo. Make it make sense. Doesn't want to be filmed. All right, let's Call fast law forward. Law enforcement or something. They, they kind of. I don't care if law enforcement is called. Your name and back. Now look, I could have left. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I could have just left, right? Right when they said it was caught. But nah, man, we wanna you know, let's see if the police respect our rights. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these three officers came in. So this guy right here in the back, uh, he's actually a trainee. He really didn't say much of nothing. Uh, this guy, he he uh, seemed he seemed cool. Honestly, these three cops, they seem cool, right? I don't know if they just really didn't know or they did know. But when that this fucking tyrant cop or well, sergeant come up, uh, sergeant or what's his name, Rogers. You know what I'm saying? We've definitely filed a complaint on Sergeant Rogers for show, for show, for show, for show. But it was just like they was quiet when they when they when they supervisor came, right? Yeah, it's Officer Abahoka, five seven nine three. Yes, sir. Five seven nine three. Yes, sir. Five seven nine three. Sir Dahl, five zero one two one. He was cool. Officer, Officer Dahl was cool. Well, Officer Dahl was cool. Oh, a trainee. Yes, okay. Can I have your name, at least? Wells. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm gonna let you guys, uh, you know, do your guys' investigation. I'm sure you gotta, you know, do your investigation. Okay. 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 Well, since I'll just talk to you guys while I'm here. Uh, so basically, I'm here to uh, conduct three things. One is to exercise my First Amendment right in public. Uh, two, I needed to get a couple stamps. And then three, I needed to get a, um, what do they call them? It's, it's I couldn't pick it up off the top, uh, passport. A passport, a passport. So apparently they don't have passports here, uh, which was understandable. And um, the lady up front, First, he said she didn't want to be recorded or anything like that. Again, I'm not doing anything nefarious. Uh, I'm not causing any harm. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, sorry, I don't want to be in people's way. But uh, yeah, I'm. You know, I'm not doing anything nefarious. I'm not. Yeah, I basically broke it down, uh, which was understandable. Just you know, documenting the place and you know the camera. Saying? They gave me anything. They just was in okay. line. Well, actually, there was no line. There was one person here. I guess oh, yeah. he didn't want to be recorded. And I said, sir, respectfully, I'm not trying to record you. I'm here to record official, you know, public servants. That's it. Okay. I guess he left. So I was like, he was next to go. He left. I walked up. The lady at the desk, she just went in the back. Okay. So I'm like, okay, so nobody's going to help me or anything. Yeah. Right. But you, you're in public and you work for the government. So. And she said she didn't want to be. Now, y'all heard what she just said, right? She contradicted herself right there. She 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 decides to chime in and say, well, yeah, cause she didn't want to be recorded. But yet you were the one that came out. And I'm assuming that you educated the, that black guy that worked for you and heard that I can. You even said that I can. And if you go back, I even said, well, did you edu uh, excuse me, ma'am? Did you uh, educate them or whatever? She said she will handle it or what whatnot. So obviously. I shouldn't even have to explain it. Y'all get what I'm saying, man. Tyrancy. Just because you don't want to be recorded doesn't mean so, that's against the law. But they, but they can, they they can refuse for you to stay in this business if you are causing concern. So right, and that's the causing concerns in public. Come on, come on, y'all, come on now. Let me get let, let me get some some First Amendment auditors on here to chime in. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. Am I causing a disturbance? No. Am I impeding on anybody's business? No, I never was in the way of people. I never even recorded anybody. Now, if you got in my lens, that's a different story, but I never recorded anybody. <sighs> this really kind of thing. I never I told her too. I never came here with okay. bad intent or ill will. I just came here to, for one, exercise my first amendment right to record in public. Right. Which right. Poster seven says that we can record okay. in public accessible areas. I haven't made an effort to go behind any restricted area or anything. I stayed right here this whole time. They, but they can trespass you from within inside the business here. So but did I, but, right now they okay, are I'm trespassing gonna... you from being inside the business. Can I actually He's going to say right now they are trespassing me. She never even gave me a trespass warning. Nothing like that. For one, how can you trespass and I'm not committing a crime and we're in public? <clears throat> I'm hot watching this. The U.S. Postal Service. 
So that means that if you do refuse to leave, you would be placed in arrest for trespassing. So, okay, but have I committed a crime? So you're trespassing. So they've already explained that because you're not, you're not, you're not conducting. He don't any know what he's talking about, here, mm -hmm. and that you're only. He already said, I'm not conducting any more business here. I tried to conduct business when I was ready to conduct my business, which was the second thing that I needed to do while I was here. Remember, the first thing was to exercise our First Amendment right peacefully to record in public. The second thing was to get a stamp. And the third thing was to get a passport. And the second and third thing is not in any. I can't even think of the word in any category. It ain't second. It ain't first. It ain't third. You know what I'm saying? But. I was ready to conduct my business and I was getting ready to go. Y'all seen it in the video. Y'all seen it in the beginning. I said, look, let me get my stamps. I'm pretty much done here. You know what I'm saying? I thought everything was cool. I walk up front. She decides to go in the back. So now they're trying to say that, oh, uh, well, yeah, you don't have any more business here. Than da, 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 da. No Fuck out but yeah, I'm going to just stop the conversation. I'll request. So I just stopped the conversation request I, uh, request for the sergeant now, which I'm about to see. Officer. It's like I, I didn't know it was the same tyrant cop, right? You before you got your stamps. Correct, correct. And at first she said, "Well, what do you need?" And I told her, and I was like, "You know, well, as long as it's business hours, I can be here, right? I I, I can be here." I'm gonna just record them, even though that's not breaking the law. But I didn't. I'm not that type of person. Finally, she comes and then I guess she called you guys. So here we are. Now, one thing I will say, this guy right here, either he knows exactly what I'm doing and he understands, but he got to, you know what I'm saying? Maybe he's trying to test me to see if I know anything or don't know anything. I'm not for sure. Or maybe he's just uneducated or he was just trained to, hey, when somebody requests a supervisor, you just shut up until your boss come here. I don't know. But overall, man, these three cops right here, they they was they was cool. You know what I mean? They didn't really like give me no pushback or say, well, he did in that little moment. He was like, well, you're trespassing. You know, they can. Da, 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 da. The other guy, they was if anything, the guy that's over here, he was just curious into like, huh? You know what I'm saying? Then they started asking questions. So do you do this, you know, full time? Da, 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 da. Uh, for one, I don't even have to tell you all that, but I'm going to just go ahead and let you know. You know what I'm saying? Like I get monetized off of it. Now I'm monetized off of TuneIn TV, obviously, but TuneIn Artists, I'm not monetized yet. You know what I'm saying? I just started the channel, but they don't, they don't need to know that. I don't give a fuck for all, for all, for all they know, I, I could be the biggest YouTuber on the motherfucking planet. You know what I mean? That, that don't matter. All right, so I moved over to the side. I peacefully waited. Let me go, go to here. a random post office. A baseball guy doing what I'm doing. So look, we just talking in. We oh, talk about there. baseball. A baseball like, we, guy. You gotta get the update. See, we, 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 yeah, we, we was cool. I'm not, you know, funny thing, I'm not even born in '80. Still, we I was, was cool. I was doing. Yes, sir. So, and then the this guy. Was, the problem with that time was because. The updated, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now even, listen. Funny thing, I'm not even born in '85. How you doing, Sergeant? How you doing? Can I get? Uh, See, when I saw that, I already knew who it was. That tyrant from the last video, and I'm still gonna go back to that post office and still go back on the side. And I don't want him there. I want somebody higher than him because, again, that's it for authorized vehicles only. That don't say nothing about trespassing or or this is restricted. I've seen other post offices says that this is restricted area no access if you're not a postal employee but not just authorized vehicles i'm not in the vehicle i'm walking on two feet but that's another story with him man i i don't, I don't like this guy right here i don't need your name and badge number i have it already I know. see I, I know i know ah man we dealt with him before so um like i said i don't know too much about this area but anyway she said you can peacefully. I have every. Come on, sorry. No, I, I don't stop my camera. Listen to him. I know okay. one guy, but you're here. They yeah. run this. No, I understand. Once we had this conversation. See, he said, I know with the one guys, but you're here. It's still a fucking public entity. Come on, Officer Rogers. You're supposed to be a sergeant. For one, your shirt ain't completely buckled up. Let's get that. Like, you're looking sloppy. Like, you're a sergeant, man. Stand up straight, too. Come on, man. Before. Exactly. So they told you what? Well, I first walked in. I came to first so you don't exercise my First Amendment right to record in public. Secondly, I came in here to get a couple stamps. Thirdly, I came to get a passport mm -hmm. application. Wait, you got a passport? The other one? Yeah, but you know. I See, I didn't even have to. I didn't even have to tell him that. Does it matter if I need one? How do you not know my dog ate the paper?
My dog ate my homework. You don't need to know that. You know what I'm saying? Because I got people that want one, so I'm just like, you know, I'm around, I'll just get another one. So, that's, that's, you know. That's a, okay. So, anyway. Yeah, I, yeah you want to you wanna know, officer? Yeah, that is my excuse. Yeah, that definitely is my excuse. For sure, for sure. Anyway, okay. no, no, seriously. But anyway, I walked in. That's the first thing I asked her. She said she didn't want to be recorded. Okay. Um, I said, you know, I'm not trying to be here to record, even though you are a public official. I can record you, and but that's not my intent. My intent is to get those documents. Right. I tried to get my uh, passport. They said they didn't have them here. I said, okay, well, I'm just going to continue uh, documenting uh, for my video, and then I'll you book right now. You didn't have one because just a week ago, you just was trying to fill out one down there. Yeah, but I told you I got some people that want I don't even have to tell you all that, but yeah, I don't, I, I, no, yeah, I don't but, understand. But anyway, so, so you saying management did not ask you to leave? I have every, sorry, I have you're everything documented. You're, you're correct. You're if correct. They, they did not they, ask me. If they choose to trespass you, then you have to go. You do understand. But am I committing a crime? Yes. Ah, <sighs> well, we dealt with this tyrannical sergeant in the last video. So again. I'm new to this whole auditing world, First Amendment shit. I'm just doing this. This shit is actually kind of exciting, y'all. So don't take me serious. You know what I mean? But I'm, I'm learning. But now, that's a crime? I don't, so if I'm on a public sidewalk and I'm recording in some way, because y'all going to see in part two, I said the same thing. I said, so, so basically, if somebody asks you to leave, that's a crime. And he said, yes. Well, then he tried to use the analogy. Well, if I'm in your mama house and, and she asked me to leave and I don't leave. Yeah, that's crime. That's that's trespassing. Nah, 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 nah. But we're talking about public, bruh. Sergeant Rogers, we're talking about public. So you basically saying if I'm on the sidewalk and somebody asks me to leave the sidewalk and I'm not causing a disturbance, I'm not being a nuisance, I'm not doing anything foul, I'm not doing anything of that nature. And they just say, hey, you need to leave. So that's a crime if I don't leave a public sidewalk. Like, make it make sense, bro. So, basically. Yeah, man. Yeah, 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 nah, yeah. So that's, but that's that know, one, y'all. Okay. Um, so, anyway. Somebody please let me know in the comments, what can I do? I mean, again, this week I am going to go and uh, file some, a couple complaints. Yeah, I mean, we definitely going to go to the uh, the post office. Or not the post office. We definitely go to the police station and see if we can uh, do a foyer on this guy. And we want to file a complaint on him. And hopefully we could talk to somebody higher than him. You know what I mean? But yeah, go over to tune in audits. Uh, full video is probably by the time y'all see this, this shit's probably already out. Yeah, this video is probably already out. Uh, yeah, man, we already at 180. Okay, okay, okay. We already at 180, man. Like, share, subscribe, man. Click that post notification bell so you can stay tapped tuned when we drop to the next one. We out.